What is up guys, it's Sobash. Welcome back. We are back with some more Brawl Stars and today we are going to cover how to get coins fast part two. Now the reason I'm doing an update to this is because a lot of things have changed over the past three weeks since I last did this. So if you've seen that previous video, a little bit of that's changed. And if this is the first time you're seeing this, make sure to leave a like on this video because it does help us out a lot. Now, some of the best ways to get coins fast is obviously completing all of your events daily. Now, daily, these are going to rotate. You have some that are on 24 hour timers, 12 hour timers, and some that are a little less, I believe maybe eight or 10 hours. But the way it's set up, Supercell has already said that you can't get any more than 180 coins from events in a 24 hour period. So these events over 24 hours, you're going to be able to accumulate 180 coins just from completing the events. Now that's not including leveling up your brawlers or leveling up your actual account level. And some better ways to do that since we've actually covered it last time was of course, getting everything completed. You know, you get your first place win just for winning. You get extra coins for that. That's factored into there. But also you have the point of this new double experience event that they do. Now, how this can actually help you get more coins is you're able to get more experience, which means you can level your account up faster. Now, I do recommend using some of the one of the five heroes that we went over in the top five video for the beginners that are wanting to do this to get coins fast right out the gate. Those guys are currently somewhat in the meta of the game, early game. So they're going to help you out the quickest and be able to basically get as many wins as possible in the earliest stages of the game for you to get more coins. Now, while we're talking about this, we're going to go ahead and jump in a mushroom cave 3v3. And uh, I'm going to grab Poco. It's a pretty good support player. Hopefully we'll get a front line and we'll also get someone that can pretty much hold the range. So we do, we have a Shelly and we have a Nita. And we're going to get some Immortus. Let's see if we can't pick up these. Now with this comp, we should hopefully be able to uh, hold mid. Try to bring those as far back towards the base as possible. That always helps out in this mode. They're coming in hot. I ate a lot of that damage. Alright, we got Alright, we got a super up now. Mortis is probably the best one to run in this. As you can tell, he's easily able to get in and out and get those gems. Which is not good for us, but if we can get those bears coming out from her. Gotta stay up. Got two kills easy on that. I'm gonna stay back and protect right here. There's no reason for me to be going out. He was immune for that first hit. Nice. I'm gonna I'm gonna work with Shelly right here. Super's ready. He missed with his as well. Nice. That should have been a kill on him, but Shelly didn't get the hit off. We need just a couple more. This is going to be hard without Nita up here. Nita can't get exposed. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Back, 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 back. Nice. All right, all we got to do is hold these guys back. Then we will safely... Yeah, Nita's gonna be able to hold him off. Nita's got the bears. I'll easily hold him off off of her. And that's how you take a win. Now, like I said, when you do these, to be able to get more coins, all right, we're gonna get the victory reward and the first win reward. Like I said, that eight is factored in to that 180 that you can get. So you'll be able to open one chest to begin with the first day, obviously just from the events. The second day you'll be opening a lot more because you'll be having a lot more coins saved up. That's if you don't go ahead and start leveling up your brawlers. Uh, now, the best thing to do I would say is if you find the brawler that you like, you see I've separated my elixir. 
that kind of hurts me i probably should have put it all into one that's why i currently saved it i'm not sure who exactly i'm going to put it all into but that's a completely different video but leveling these guys up you see i've leveled up pretty much every one i've got at least to five six somewhere in there and you see a couple of these guys are going to be a lot harder to level up like brock and dynamite if you're playing by yourself because they're not really a good part of the meta they can't really take hits these other guys you'll see the ones that are easily able to be leveled up the trophies are easy to get on them for showdown mode for some cases like bull poco and uh bow some like that are good with bounty mode it's just find the meta for the current game mode or event that you're playing and that will make getting these coins a lot easier for you now uh, let's go ahead let's uh let's try out heist mode now with heist mode i like i like going with uh barley i like taking barley in heist mode let's see if we can't get something going with barley all right so we're defending now the uh the thing is up to 9,000 hit points it used to be a lot lower now there's nothing here to protect and let these guys be able to come immediately in so we're going to try to keep this uh needle away definitely work on this cold over here trying to hide in the bush put that tick on him okay we'll just get him right here then all right this is I, I like this map this map is definitely good for uh barley because of all the defense you can have basically with using that wall now if that uh that colt was actually smart he would have utilized his super already he would have got in and did that poke damage and broke that wall down uh, that's probably going to be their only hope of actually winning All right, he actually caught me there with one. Let's see. She went the wrong side. Thank you. All right, I'll help you with that. Go ahead and let's go. I don't want to waste the super here. I'll go ahead and take the death. I'll definitely drop a super on her, though. Take that bear down pretty quick. Let him do as little damage as possible. Definitely. Ah, let's get this colt. Let's get the colt. Nice. He can't be getting in there doing that much damage. All right, we got 30 seconds to hold him off. We just need to push up. He's dead. Nice. So much commotion. The uh, sound kind of cut out for a second. And that's pretty much it for these guys. They're not going to make it back to the base. There's what, Anita left maybe? No, I think she died as well. But yeah, heist mode is definitely a lot of fun now. As you can see, Barley's. A lot of people have said Barley or double up characters is not really fair. That's only because of the beta. And uh, if you have any more questions about that, just ask in the comments. I'll feel, I will answer. But right there, 10 for the rank up. Of course, it used to be 20. That's why I'm coming back and redoing this because not only do you get less for ranking up your characters now you also can get more from just doing everything daily and continuously playing the game and it doesn't take a lot of time to actually do this within an hour i usually collect all of my coins and if i don't want to play anymore that day i don't have to because i've already collected everything now I do just keep tabs on it in case something does pop up and another big huge tip guys make sure you always have these things completely maxed out finish these coins off as quick as possible because currently when they do updates if the server is brought down when the server comes back up all of the events are reset and you can get more coins out of that same day so remember that if the server goes down 
remember to log back in immediately and pick up all those coins and do those things again when it comes up because that can be a huge chunk and give you an extra two three even maybe four boxes in a single day oh uh, i've got enough to open one box we'll try it we got an elixir we got 20 elixir saved up i've yet still figured out who i want to put this in guys but like i said if you have any more questions about how to get these coins feel free to leave them in the comments below as well i'm always available to answer questions and yeah that's going to be it uh if you have any questions like i said yeah it's it's their comment section that's that's what we're here for guys but that's going to be it for this video thank you guys so much for watching and like i said just leave a like on the video it does help us out a lot but yeah that's going to be it for me as always like comment and subscribe I am Solvash. You guys have a nice day.